1,000 pound sisters Tammy Sladen convinced she's pregnant due to her unusual appetite Tammy said she noticed a strange appetite and that she could be pregnant 1,000 pound sister visits thrive. Cindy Basinski on Tuesday's episode of the hit series Tammy wanted to explore the possibility of having a baby after losing a lot of weight, so she took her sister Amy with her. And when she confided her thoughts about pregnancy to her gynecologist, she even admitted that there was a slight possibility that she was already pregnant. But if the reason she made this speculation is any indication, most of us could be carrying little babies right now. See the moment that made viewers laugh here, Tammy first told the doctor, I want to know if I can get pregnant. I want to make sure everything is healthy there. She had an IUD inserted, but it had to be removed in 2016. So she's still in there. For reference, most IUDs last between 3 and 12 years, and often need to be replaced within 5 years of insertion. So Tammy had hers in there for a while. Though her sister Amy says she is permanent residence, Tammy also admitted that she wasn't sexually active at the time. Because her husband, Caleb Willingham, was living in a rehab facility out of state. Right now, there's a small chance I might be pregnant, she said but she couldn't even remember when her last period was. See why she thinks so, I have cravings for weird things that I don't normally crave, she explained. Like water. Craving water? That left Amy laughing at the camera while her sister and doctor were totally silent. Thirsty woman, go get yourself some water. You're not pregnant, you're just thirsty. It's going to be okay, Amy said. Ex-viewers laughed out loud at Tammy's request and said they shed actual tears, another said. Silence in the exam room was loud. One wrote, I thought she was going to say something serious, many said. I really love this solo, while another wrote, wow, her sister always comes to pick me up. And another simply added, well, I don't think she's pregnant. 1,000 pounds sisters Tammy Sladden attacks haters. Shows off astonishing beyond recognition transformation 1,000 pound sisters star Tammy Sladden has issued a response to online trolls. Tammy and her sister Amy are documenting their weight loss journey on the TLC reality show, which began with them weighing more than 1,000 pounds combined. In season 4, Tammy met Caleb Willingham and they married in November 2022 at a rehab facility. Sladden said on the show that when she saw Willingham at the altar, she thought of doves and butterflies and felt like God opened the clouds and let the sunlight in. Sadly, Willingham recently passed away at age 40, and Tammy spoke about the passing on TikTok. Despite suffering a lot of trauma in recent months, the reality TV star continues her incredible journey to lose weight. In fact, many have argued that after her incredible 200 kilograms weight loss on the reality show, Tammy has looked healthier than ever of the 1,000 pound sisters star know that she's a regular on TikTok, where she keeps her fans updated. A recent video, Tammy commented in the caption, I'm just living my best life lol I'm stupid. I just wanted to laugh with you all. Since then, Tammy has thanked her followers for their kind comments, but also addressed some of the criticism she's faced. In her unboxing video, Tammy said she's happy about all the comments, all the hate, good and bad. Tammy even addressed the haters directly. I'm praying for you. The comments on this particular TikTok were very positive, with the majority praising Tammy's progress. Saying, all the haters making fun of me. Your moves and your groove. You look great. One person sent love. Tammy. I did the show again, and girl. But when Tammy was convinced she was pregnant due to her unusual desires. You killed it, added the second. She wanted to explore the possibility of losing weight and then having a baby, so she took her sister Amy with her. And when she confided her thoughts about pregnancy to her gynecologist, she even admitted that there was a slight possibility that she was already pregnant. We want to make sure everything in there is healthy. I just want to know if I can get pregnant. So she's still in it, she says. She had an IUD put in, but it had to be removed in 2016.